In this video, we are going to talk about how to convert your WordPress website into a different language and create a multilingual website. So if that sounds interesting, then let's dive in. So here we are in our WordPress backend and in order to convert our current website and its content into a different language, we need to use a plugin. And in this video, we are going to use WPML, which is one of the most popular WordPress plugin when it comes to creating a multilingual website. So in order to start using this plugin, you need to purchase the required plan from here and then upload the plugin on your WordPress website. So we have already done the purchase. So let's go back in the WordPress backend and we will go to plugins and then click on add new and then click on upload plugin and then choose the zip file that we have downloaded from our purchased account. So here is a zip file for our plugin from WPML and let's click on install and then click on activate plugin. So now our WPML plugin is installed. Here we can go ahead and configure this plugin. So let's go ahead and click here. So on the first step, it's asking us about the language. So this is a default language that is English. So our current website is in English and you want to translate this into maybe Hindi or you can choose any of your native language from here. So right now we will go with Hindi and then click on continue. And after that, we have an option to choose how we want to rewrite our new URLs. So you can do that depending upon your preference for SEO. So right now I'm just going with the addition of parameter in the URL. So after that, let's click on continue. And now we have an option if you want to translate everything on our WordPress website or some of its parts. So if we choose some parts, and here we get an option for who will translate. So right now it's selected me as a user. So I will continue from here. And right now it's asking for the support. So I will click on no and then just continue. All right. So now we can go ahead and start translating our website. So if we click on finish. So here we are on the translate management dashboard. And here we can see the sample pages and sample blog post. And below that we have select translation option. So we have already selected as Hindi for translation. So that's why it's showing here. On the next step, we have an option for translators. So if you want to add a new translator, you can do that from here. And after that, we have automatic translation. So using the credits of WPML, you can easily do the automatic machine translation for your website. So if you want to go with that, you can go ahead and purchase the credits from here. So now if you want to translate our sample post, we can go back in the post list here and we have our sample post added here. And right next to this, we have a Indian flag and with a plus sign here and which denotes that we can add a Hindi translation for this content. So let's click here. All right. So here is all the text that is in our sample post. And from here, we can add a translation. So let's go ahead and quickly add the one. So let's say the first one is Hello World, which is the title of our post. And here on the right hand side, it shows the English original version. And after that, we can type in our Hindi version. So you might need to use an external typing tool to write in your native language and then paste it here. And once it's done, just click on this check here. And this will add the Hindi translation for our title. Same goes for the rest of the other content. So let's go ahead and quickly do that. So here we have added Hindi version of all these texts, but we are leaving the last one as in English itself. So just to see how it looks in the front end. So now we have completed the translation 100%. Let's go ahead and click on complete. Now the translation is done. So let's view this page in the front end. So here we have the normal sample blog post in English. And if we scroll down here, we have an Hindi version. So let's click here. And now we have our content in Hindi. And as you can see, we have not added any translation to this part of the text. So this is showing as it is in English. And if you notice that many other title and metadata is already getting translated into Hindi. So in this way, we can easily translate our WordPress website posts as well as pages. 
If you like this video, then make sure you hit the like button and to watch more videos like this, subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell so that you can get notified whenever we upload our next video. And if you need any expert help regarding your website, you can connect with us using the link given in the video description below. So that's it for this one and I'll see you in the next video.